Greetings, food surfers. I'm Eric Surf Six. Welcome to Eric Meal Time. Today's meal is Family Mart. Let's go in and have a look. Should we get some flowers first. Destination up there. Whoa, check this out. Whoa, it just got ripped right out of the ground, it fell down the hill. So they cut it, and here's the rest of it. <laughs> yeah, okay. Is that one gonna be next? I think we'll be good. So it's about 30 minutes to get up to the top. I don't know about you guys, but I'm starving. When do we get to eat? After I show you this little forest right here. This is green year round. Yep, this is where the Inoshishi or wild boar live. I've seen them on this path here. Alrighty, we've got the goods. Let's chow down. And the total price for the goods here are 1,878 yen. That's about 15, 16 dollars. So we'll start off with the drink, I think. This is Sokembicha. Sokembicha. Tea. Caffeine free, sugar free. Plain and simple. Yep, just the way tea should be. All right, so we'll start off with the salad. This is the salad for today. We've got some Mekons here. Local produce. These are a type of mandarin orange. Let's give them a try. And typically these are seedless as well too. They are the perfect orange. Mm. Nice and tart, but also sweet at the same time. Just right, juicy. Oh yeah. Easy to peel. It takes a couple of seconds. There it is. And just that's about one bite right there, isn't it? You just pop it in your mouth. Mm-hmm. Mmm. Oh, good. It's better than store bought. Yeah, it's nice that the local convenience stores do this. Not the ones in the bigger cities, but the ones out here in the countryside, they do. They sell the local farm produce. Alrighty, moving on. Next up, we've got some sushi. Nice see-through pack there. So you know exactly what you're getting. I like that. Pop it open. Yeah, packaging is, is brilliant in Japan. It really is. There's a crab one, crab cucumber, and it looks like some scrambled egg. Mm-hmm. Mm, it's nicely seasoned. A bit salty. I think it's got some I'm gonna not show you, but something. Mm-hmm. Yeah. And this one is sea chicken or tuna, tuna fish. Oh, you get quite a bit of tuna fish. Mm -hmm. And there is a packet to show you in here. So, mm -hmm. 
let's use that on whatever's coming up here. Let's use that on the imitation crab. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Tasty. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Moving along, we have got another salad. These are salad beans, five different types of beans in here. I love these, just beans ready to eat. There they are. They're easy eats, no chopsticks necessary. Mm -hmm. There's a lot of beans. It's a total of 85 grams of beans and it's only 133 calories. That's a lot of beans in there. Round two. Yeah, these are tasty. Next up is a sandwich. This is the ham and cheese on a baguette. And out of all the convenience stores, I think this is my favorite sandwich. So if I go to the Family Mart, I always buy this one, if it's in stock. And I do have some mayonnaise today, which I also bought <laughs> at the store. So that's kind of nice, like 50, 60 cents for this. Cupy mayonnaise. Yeah, all convenience stores sell this. Pretty sweet. Okay, and there is some mayonnaise on this already, but I think I'm just gonna add a little bit more. Yeah, because there's no vegetables on here except for the lettuce. Yep, that's, it's pretty simple. So ham, cheese, lettuce, and mayonnaise. And it's a nice soft bun. Going in. Mm. Mm. Mm -mm -mm. It's a decent sandwich. I would like if it had some onions and some tomatoes on it would make it better, but hey, that's the way it is. Keeps the shelf life a little bit longer, I think. Mm -hmm. not, not bad for a convenience store. The bread's pretty fresh, nice and soft. Mm -hmm. A tasty sandwich. Mm. Yep. And adding the mayonnaise, yeah, I think makes it just right. Next item up for bids is, what are we gonna do here? Let's do something sweet. This is a chocolate cream taiyaki is the name of this. It's a very famous Japanese sweet. Shaped like a fish. And there's many different types of these, but the chocolate's a bit rare, like custard and like regular cream is popular, but to have the chocolate in here, I don't think I've ever had it like this. So double chocolate. Mmm. Oh. It's got a nice kind of sponginess texture to it. It's different from the barbecue type on the street. Mmm. Oh, yeah. And that chocolate inside. Oh, it's like a really rich pudding. That's delish. No onco bean paste on this guy. Mm-hmm. Oh, it's a lot of sweets. Total calories here, 249. Mm-hmm. See, this massive thing of beans right here is 133 calories. And then this is 249. 
and this is gone in two seconds. So this, I've still got, what, three quarters of the pack left or more. So shall I be eating more beans in the future? I think we shall. Okay. Next up, we had to do it. We had to do it again because Family Mart has the best chicken in Japan. So this is the DIY chicken sandwich. Some of you love it, some of you hate it, but I got to do it because every time it's different. This bread we have today is, let me read it, garlic butter France. So French bread, garlic butter, and some herbs on it as well too. That's going to be a really nice piece of bread for the sandwich. Oh, smell that garlic butter. And let's dress it up with some mayo too. Yep, today's a mayonnaise day. So they call their family mart chick, family chiki. And then look at that, it's, it's just gorgeous. It was a gorgeous piece of chicken that doesn't, actually the chicken hardly fits on here. Typically, I like to fold it up. Let's just eat it like this. You got, or shall we fold it up? I don't know. Let's fold it up. That's the standard, but it see it hangs off the edge there. Oh well. Okay, that's what it looks like. All right, let's bite in from the side since it's hanging out. Oh, still warm. Mmm. Oh, it's like KFC. Oh, it's bursting with flavor. Mmm. Super, super juicy. Oh, <laughs> oh my goodness. God, the chicken's got a really nice crispiness. I mean, they really do it right. It blows away the 7-Eleven for sure. And I'm tasting a lot of garlic and butter mm -hmm. and salt. Oh, yeah. That is tasty. Mm. Mm, 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 mm. This might be the best DIY chicken sandwich I've had yet. Last item is the Black Thunder chocolate. 200% something. The packaging's 200% larger, huh? Oh, I guess you do get more. This is bonus, huh? That's a lot in there. So they're bite-sized pieces, which is nice. Mm -hmm. How do I describe this? Mm. Well, first of all, it's my number one favorite chocolate in Japan. And it's got a cookie inside, basically. A chocolatey cookie inside. Black Thunder. So there it was, the Family Mart. I think, I think the Family Mart might just be my favorite. So the top three convenience stores in Japan are 7-Eleven, Family Mart, and Lawson. And I believe they're in that order for the amount of sales that they do, the number of stores. Yeah, so on my rating scale between one and six Eric heads today, where are we gonna go? I think we're gonna go five out of six. It's almost a six, almost. The chicken sandwich is really, really good today. I enjoyed that a lot. And I like the meat cons. I like that you can get local produce. Yep, that's nice, the mandarin oranges. Some other good items as well too. The sushi was nice, so yeah. I'm glad I had the mayonnaise to add to the uh, sandwich because it was a bit dry. So that's gonna do it for this one. I wanna thank you guys for watching. Give the video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. And as always, I look forward to reading your comments. We'll see you in the next one. Eric out.